Hey what's up guys, Jason here today. Well, while the Galaxy Note 10.1 wasn't one of the most resounded Android tablets of the past year, it's still one of the best Android tablets around. And let's get started to why I think this is a tablet you should get over the Nexus 10. The world is mine. As you can see here, the device runs a custom ROM, and this is Omega's custom ROM. You can get it from the XTA forums, and as you can see, my ROM is themed, themed to the peak. It's themed like a boss, and this theme is going to be distributed very soon. It makes the ROM and the looks of the tablet become absolutely outstanding. And no one said the display on this tablet was bad. It's not bad at all still very very good to look at even though it doesn't compare to Nexus 10 and the iPad in terms of retina like displays and then you can see every single thing is themed you get curved menus and curved design on the menus and the blue overlay at the bottom and it makes everything look very new and nice to look at and all you can see uh, you can see icon packs every single place home menu and recent apps button have been changed and then before you could move around your windows you could resize them pin them and do any single thing you wanted to do with them and move them out from the multi window bar but now with this ROM you have the ability to add custom kind of kind of third-party apps to the multi-window bar like I added ES Explorer and I added many others like Google Maps and you can do it with any other app it comes with a pre-installed stuff inside called the MW window Ma MW manager and this manager can be used actually to do that kind of thing and then with five finger gestures to go back home which I'll get to in a second which makes it like somehow just just on the iPad and this ROM is a very very snappy ROM on this device it makes the device very very quick which it was quick before it wasn't why I put this ROM I put this ROM actually for the theme and for the other values it adds to the tablet and the tablet has also a very very good battery life as you can see or maybe as you can see but at times I get one week out of usage from this tablet and I replaced my gallery app with um, Photodesk. Photodesk is actually a very good app, which is better than a gallery app. And then you get gestures like four fingers swiping through apps. As you can see, so my four fingers are swiped through all my apps. And five fingers take me home. Three fingers takes me back, takes me back if I was in an app or something, it just takes me back. Three fingers swipe up, takes me to multitasking. Three fingers back was three fingers down, three fingers up is multitasking. Three finger gestures toggle here between the home screen and the app drawer and you can go back and forth using three fingers or five fingers when you're on the app drawer or home screen. And five finger anti-clockwise turn switches on the lock screen and turns off the screen. And this is done by an app called GMT Gesture Controls which you can see there I I've got some toggles on and some toggles off. You can also add custom pinch to zoom actions or pinch actions with your fingers and any other actions you want to add. It's got tons and tons of stuff and so much you can learn, so much you can do. It's, it depends on you and what you want to do. And then the lock screen, the lock screen 
is the same lock screen with the news feed at the bottom and then you can get to apps by swiping through them from down to bottom to top and the S Pen, the S Pen that adds value to this tablet so much you can use it to pick through your calendar, pick through your emails, pick through your gallery videos, play videos and even get to a certain point you were missing maybe in a movie and get back and you can even pick through pictures and that's why I love the S Pen, it's just much 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 addition to this tablet. I'm actually a student and this helps me a lot as I use the note as my primary notebook help me helps me to stop wasting papers and actually keep my stuff online and it never gets missing of course it can store in my gmail or my samsung account and you can copy things from the web directly and clip them into a notebook and you can see flip like page gestures and i use the s pen actually as my keyboard but here this is a swift key keyboard which i use on the normal usage without the s pen and then when i get out the s pen the tablet changes the keyboard to the samsung keyboard because it has the best handwriting recognition features for the s pen and only when the s pen is out does it bring me that keyboard and when the s pen is in it brings me swift key which is actually very good because i like toggling between the two and this action is actually brought up by another app which you can side load to your device or you can decide to let it just be from the ROM because the ROM comes with this app and when I put back my S Pen I get back to SwiftKey easily. The app is called S Pen Board Switcher which you can get from the SD and side load but it comes for by default with this ROM and then I love the way the device multitask is almost like on a PC you can get a video playing in the background and you're still on the web browsing and I usually use a pop-up play feature on this I don't use pop-up play because pop-up play to me seems ugly I just use the multi window feature for videos because I can have more control over the video by pinning it or pinning out and you also can view things the way you want you can go back in the app like there you can go back in the app and do where opposed to the pop-up feature where you can't go back in the app you just have to stop the video from playing but you have full controls if you just use multi window manager on the video and I open the verge which is a very very heavy website and doing any single thing pinch into zoom you can see it's very very snappy not like what you guys saw with ice here's jelly bean changes this and with jelly bean every single thing just becomes snappy the best experience ever and on this screen that's gorgeous even though not as gorgeous as the nexus 10 but the tablet has a lot of value more than the nexus 10 and when you see Nicki Minaj dancing, you can't say no. It's just beautiful to look at. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel as this will help me and motivate me to keep on making more videos for you guys, the watchers. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for more videos every week.